Is it time to buy or sell Taiwan Semiconductor stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Taiwan Semiconductor. Our initial report was published on our website on Tuesday, 28th May, 2024, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for any one among 20,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since May 3rd, 2024, our system has ranked Taiwan Semiconductor as a buy candidate, giving it a score of 2.68. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. Those who followed our analysis would have enjoyed an impressive gain of 12.61% since we first listed Taiwan Semiconductor as a buy candidate 17 days ago. This translates to an average return of 0.74% per day since it was listed as buy candidate. The stock lies in the upper part of a wide and weak rising trend in the short term, and this may normally pose a very good selling opportunity for the short-term trader as reaction back towards the lower part of the trend can be expected. A breakup at the top trend line at $161.89 will firstly indicate a stronger rate of rising. The current three-month trend suggests a potential 9.33% change over the next three months, with a possible return between negative 8.37% and 11.03%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a 56.70% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between 17.42% and 57.50%. This translates to a price range of $187.18 to $251.08 after a year. Our latest daily update for Taiwan Semiconductor includes the headline, Stronger Technical Forecast for Taiwan Semiconductor Stock Price After Tuesday Trading. The Taiwan Semiconductor Stock Price fell by negative 0.369% on the last day, Tuesday, 28th May 2024, from $160 to $159.41. During the last trading day, the stock fluctuated 1.76% from a day low at $157.60 to a day high of $160.38. The price has risen in seven of the last 10 days and is up by 8.88% over the past two weeks. Volume has increased on the last day by 2 million shares, but on falling prices. This may be an early warning, and the risk will be increased slightly over the next couple of days. In total, 14 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $2,220,000,000. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $160.78, and the lowest price was $84.02. Currently, the price is 0.85%, or $1.37, below the 52-week high of $160.78, which is also the all-time high for stock. Analyst ratings on Wednesday, May 22, 2024, it was reported that Needham gave TSM a buy grade with a hold action. On Friday, April 19, 2024, it was reported that Goldman Sachs gave TSM a buy grade with a hold action. On Thursday, April 18, 2024, it was reported that Needham gave TSM a buy grade with a hold action. On Thursday, April 18, 2024, it was reported that Daiwa gave TSM a outperform grade with a downgrade action. On Thursday, April 18, 2024, it was reported that Wedbush gave TSM an outperform grade with a hold action. Analysts have given Taiwan Semiconductor stock a general strong buy rating. They rate the price-to-earnings ratio as strong buy 
and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a strong buy rating. The following signals have been identified for Taiwan Semiconductor. The Taiwan Semiconductor stock holds buy signals from both short and long-term moving averages, giving a positive forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general buy signal from the relation between the two signals where the short-term average is above the long-term average. On corrections down, there will be some support from the lines at $155.94 and $143.92. A breakdown below any of these levels will issue sell signals. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Friday, May 24, 2024, and so far it has fallen negative 0.369%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Volume rose on falling prices yesterday. This may be an early warning, and the stock should be followed more closely. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, buy signal. Pivots, sell signal two days ago. Bollinger, buy signal nine days ago. Short-term moving average, buy signal 18 days ago. Long-term moving average, buy signal 18 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal 16 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we see short moving average, buy signal 18 days ago. The long-term moving average, buy signal 137 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages, buy signal 128 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, risk, and stop loss for Taiwan Semiconductor. On the downside, the stock finds support just below today's level from accumulated volume at $149.20 and $146.37. There is a natural risk involved when a stock is testing a support level since if this is broken, the stock then may fall to the next support level. In this case, Taiwan Semiconductor finds support just below today's level at $149.20. If this is broken, then the next support from accumulated volume will be at $146.37 and $132.27. This stock has average movements during the day and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. During the last day, the stock moved $2.78 between high and low, or 1.76%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 2.10%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for Taiwan Semiconductor, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price-to-earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per-share earnings. This is a relatively normal P-E ratio, often seen in businesses with long track records or predictable revenues. In other news, the next earnings report for Q2 2024 is expected on July 18, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates are at $1.33. Keep an eye on these numbers as they can greatly impact stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Taiwan Semiconductor. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Taiwan Semiconductor is at $160. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, Taiwan Semiconductor encounters its first support level at $149.20. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point, anticipating a rebound. Our recommended stop loss is set at $155.39 a decrease of 2.52%. This stock has medium daily movements, posing a moderate level of risk.
The Relative Strength Index, RSI 14, is 76, significantly increasing the risk. Additionally, there is a sell signal from a pivot top identified 26 days ago. Is Taiwan Semiconductor stock a good buy? Several short-term signals, along with a general good trend, are positive, and we conclude that the current level may hold a buying opportunity as there is a fair chance for Taiwan Semiconductor stock to perform well in the short term. We have upgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a hold accumulate to a buy candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For trading on Wednesday, May 29th, we expect Taiwan Semiconductor to open down negative $0.28 and start trading at $159.13. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.